hi there. Welcome your faces to uh, Tom in beautiful quality. Um, you're going to see this camera actually get kind of failed set up in the vlog you're about to watch. But get comfy, get your food, your snacks, your popcorn, your drinks, your whatever. Because this video is indeed an hour long. And you might be like, uh, Tom, what is this? Where have the vlogs been and why is this an hour long? Uh, well, the simple answer is uh, I've been daily vlogging every day. But, because I've been playing Blackout that much, and my sleep schedule's been so screwed, uh, and because it got past 6pm every day by the time I got up, I was just like, yeah, well, I won't post a vlog today, or this, is this. Then I forgot that I'd vlogged the day, and because I forgot that I vlogged the day, I just never ended up editing it or posting it to YouTube. So what you're about to see is an entire week's worth of vlogs put into a movie so we can play catch-up, because our boy Orion jumped on board, edited it together, and we'll be editing the d d d d d d daily vlogs from here out. So everyone, if you want to give uh, Orion a welcome in the comments down below, I really appreciate that. And without further ado, I hope you enjoy the video. I'm sorry for the delay. Hopefully, you like this camera because this is my new... Look at this. Look at... Wait, wait. I'm going to show you. Where's... Oh, where's my button? There it is. This is uh, my new camera for my streaming, by the way. Again, I've been daily live streaming. Yeah, you, th you tell you about daily vlogging. I've been daily live streaming on twitch.tv forward slash syndicate. And if you want to come and watch me play Blackout all day, every day, then go to twitch.tv forward slash syndicate. And if not, you're an idiot and you're missing out. Uh, but yeah, at the same time, if you don't, <laughs> if you don't actually like um, Call of Duty or Blackout, I understand, it's no problem. No, 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 no offense or whatever. I know you come here to watch the vlogs and lifestyle stuff and travel and adventure and all that. But um, it is what it is. Also, before we get into this, um, this is a real, real change of pace. Um, and serious Tom for a second, but a lot of you guys didn't know a uh, piece of information I've not shared with you guys um, and I'm just gonna put it out like like this and it's not like a title or a video or a clickbait or anything like that You know, I, I, I didn't want to put it across like this, but my granddad actually got diagnosed with cancer He got bowel cancer and we actually thought cancer was written off out of the picture and all was good And we were in the clear, you know, we just had his operation with his bag But unfortunately uh, they did a test and the sample they sent off of his bowel uh, it turned out to be cancerous, so we were all panicking and worrying that um, the cancer might have spread because of how long he's had it, sort of thing. Uh, we didn't know any of the situation, so we've set, we had he had more scans and uh, and all that sort of stuff. So uh, a good thing to know is uh, bowel cancer is a really good cancer to fight. A lot of the people, it's like a ninety percent chance of something of beating it, um, and the operation is to like go in, cut it out, and remove it if it hasn't spread. But he had to do new tests, so we did the test. Lo and behold, the test came back negative for it spreading. So what they've managed to do and locate is where the cancer is. They're going to go in, operate, and remove the cancerous section of it, and then potentially be able to remove his bag off his side and reconnect his system, like connect his... Thank you his bum hole. It'll, it'll get his bottom back again. So, you know my granddad is in positive vibes and positive spirits. I've not mentioned this just because we've been I've been waiting for the next set of test results before we find out whether the cancer has spread anywhere or anything like that. But my granddad's a fighter. He's awesome. The amount of love and support you guys sent over was just absolutely incredible. And I can't thank you guys enough. The cards, the letters, everything like that. You know, the Jaguar all the way from New York. That little stuff, cuddly tie was amazing. And uh, yeah, honestly, guys, thank you so much for sending all the love and the positive vibes because it has really paid off so he's gonna have to have another operation i'm not too sure when that is i'll keep you guys posted in like the vlogs and stuff like that but i'm kind of really glad that i finally managed to tell you guys this um away from it being like you know bad news type like you know clickbait standard title most people can do sort of thing but i just thought i'd put this across here and uh, yeah wrap up so that was another three minutes added to the start of this vlog guys thank you for for listening to me and without further ado enjoy the video you will maybe like it because it's long and if you didn't watch the whole thing then you're a son of a bitch and you know i mentioned the word jaguar before well ladies and gentlemen next week i may be getting the jaguar Good morning to your faces, or oh, if you're watching this at 6 o'clock, good evening. Uh, but I'm just going to say apologies for the previous vlog thumbnail, because this is what I went for. Yeah, I'm not too sure what I was thinking. Like, uh, with my vlogs, I just film whatever happens throughout my day, and it's nothing, like, kind of, like, significant. Like, I don't exactly get a good picture or a thumbnail, because this camera's a piece of potato quality. You kind of just get stuck with, uh, with, with that. But it's a new dawn, it's a new day. Got up nice and early on a Saturday today. I actually got up at 9 o'clock on a Saturday, which is kind of strange for me. Being honest, it really is not, not something I'm used to. But uh, I've managed to get my vlog edited. I did it, uploaded it to the channel, and it's ready for 6 o'clock. But 
at two o'clock today. I'm going out with Lydia, Carl, and my granddad to the grapes. Wiz is going to cook us up some food and we're going to have a meal. Before then, we need to pop down to Lydia's house and feed the cats. So you may see a fat Gadsby. So let's go and see how that pooping bug is doing. And look how foggy it is outside. Psych, I'm joking. You ready for a magic trick if you've never seen this? This is called Magic Switchcast. Look, you can't see through it. You ready? Three, two, one, switch. Ooh, kind of cool, right? Kind of. What the heck? That was the craziest timing to just randomly see a horse riding past. Okay, bye now. <laughs> I dip Steve's locust in calcium. <laughs> and look at it, it's just like a walking round our beetle little cricket. <laughs> look, so, I right, take a, oh no, I've got to hold my legs, no. Look, so I take, a no I take a normal one, dip it in the calcium. Sorry, this seems really harsh, but he's going to get eaten in two seconds. And then throw him in. And now he's a calciumed up cricket. <laughs> Because I truly can't be bothered with uh, the package person coming today and being like, hey, you weren't in, I couldn't give it you. I'm left, I'm leaving a note on the door being like, please leave it with my neighbor. So fingers crossed, you leave it with the neighbor. Oh wow, there's so much bird poo on that door. Ew, that's disgusting. Anyway, next stop, the ca oh my God, there's so much bird poo on my car as well. Mate, that tree's gotta go. Hello there, fat boy. Fatty, fatty, fat boy. Hello there, you fat little bugger. How you doing? Hello. How you doing? Hello. Yeah, that park is pretty good. We're turning up to the grapes right now to see my granddad have some dinner. And not only that, we're making him a present. A jigsaw. It was meant for the hospital. Bloody hell. Yeah. Look at all the fat coming out of West Extractor. Anyway, um, we were supposed to, we tried to order this in time for whilst he was in hospital, whilst he was bored, but uh, now he's out, he can still have it. So I got him a, his favorite train, a flying Scotsman, a jigsaw piece. What he doesn't know, <laughs> I've kept one piece. <laughs> I'm joking, that's really harsh. Hey, hey, DJ. hey I've got you a present. Okay. You were supposed to get it when you were in hospital, but... Flying Scots. Flying Scots. Flying Scots. Jigsaw. Oh yeah. Oh well, don't want that now, he's not in hospital. He's sick. He's like, yeah, you can have that cow. I don't want you think hey, you think he wants to really put a thousand piece puzzle together? No, thank you. Peri peri chips? No. Cajun chicken and peri peri chicken. What have you got there? Cajun chicken. Cajun chicken and granum, what are you having? Again. I'm alright. <laughs> what are you having? You're having fish and chips again. Twenty nine pounds. Twenty nine pounds. Worth every penny. Oh. Worth every penny. Look, he does have an afro under that hat. I'll give you, I'll give you, I'll donate a thousand pounds to charity if you grow it. Or it. I'll grow it. Oh, it is actually. <laughs> you, should, you need a comb in it. I'll donate a thousand pounds to charity if you grow it for an entire year. Don't trim it, don't cut it. Alright, well, it's so next year. So next year? Oh, fuck, it's wedding. January! I need to have your wedding pictures. <laughs> I'm doing you with it an afro. <laughs> That would be sick. Bom 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 Mr. Sandman. Give me the key. Bo bo bo. Is that the word? What are you doing? Just talking. Oh no. Bye, Granddad. Bye, no. Bye, Granddad. Bye, Carl. Bye, Granddad. Bye, Carl. Oh, he's so cute. Mr. Sandman. Give me the. Have you got his jigsaw? Okay, sweet. <laughs> Let's go there. I've decided I'm going to cook ribeyes tonight, so that's going to be an absolute failure. If I was cooking one, it probably wouldn't be a problem, but the fact that I'm cooking three, it's going to go wrong. So I'm going to need three tasty looking ribeye steaks. Oh, that looks like a good one right there. Look at that. Juicy. Medium. Three minutes each side. You like the look of it? I like the, the, I like the fillet you do. No, not fillet. Um, so so I don't know you do. Do you want sirloin like instead? Like Do you want sirloin like instead? You can have that one, I can All right. All right. Two ribeyes, one sirloin. Come up. I'm so tired. Because you are. I'm tired of my <laughs> shit. <laughs> Home baking, aka Lydia's favourite aisle. This is where you can get everything and anything. Even a polar bear. Look at that. Beautiful. And only £1.50 each. Damn, Daniel. Oh, man. Like a fool. I uh, went out all day and I completely forgot that, you know, uh, my scuff controller thumbsticks were supposed to be getting re-delivered today, but um, I got the parcel note saying, we'll be back tomorrow, which is great, but then they've not been back to tomorrow, 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 today, they didn't, they didn't come today. 
and I've had no miss like piece of paper saying we tried to drop it off but you weren't in but I've got a package for a neighbour but they're not in and I was like I really want to you know not leave it on my doorstep so I'd rather give it to them but then the problem is like it's raining so I don't exactly want to leave it out in the rain so I put it down and I was like that's probably a bad idea that's being a bad neighbour so I'm gonna take it back to my house now and uh, look after it it's always it's always frustrating that when the package isn't able to be dropped off with you like yeah sure and then, then it's like well we can't give it to a neighbor because you know we can't we can't give it to the neighbor because of whatever reason you know you have to sign for it understandable but like at least give me the location of the depot so oh the door's open sorry <laughs> at least give me the address of the depot so i can just go and pick it up myself or something you know but nope <sighs> it's always hard work the postal service in the uk is just backwards fuming Mate, I'm watching Carl play and I'm getting like anxiety of like a backseat gamer. Carl's got the ability to heal himself to like 200 health, which is like maximum health, right? But he's not doing it. He's not repairing his armor. And there's just decisions he's not making. And I'm like, Carl, please, you can do this. Like he's, st like he's standing out in the open. I'm like, oh, Carl, you can win this game. He can really, really win this game. He's just got to play smart. Oh, <laughs> look at that guy's dead face. <laughs> Very random flex, but check this out, right? So this is my setup. So like when I'm editing or playing Minecraft, this is my setup, right? But then when I switch to playing Blackout, check this out. I hold this second button and then it raises only by the slightest amount, but to the perfect amount for my eyeline to be try harding like a beast on this game. And I'm one win away from 100. Lydia's just got back from a night. Obviously, the first thing we do is uh, eat food. Oh, well done, Carl. Asleep. Oh, yeah, you probably heard that. I know. Uh, God, look how tired I look. One, it's three o'clock in the morning. You know, I've been going to bed at like midnight. I'm absolutely exhausted. Staying up at three a.m. There's no way I'm getting up at nine. Oh, we're getting up. We've got to go for the We're doing some. Domino's chicken wing. Yes, boy. The wind be blowing in my face and it's a cold hours morning in England. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome your faces to a very windy vlog. January blues, innit? It's just a grey old day. And where was it? Look, there's still firework remains from when, from New Year's. Like, don't be wrong, like, it's not exactly going to go anywhere because, you know, it's a piece of plastic. It can't degrade, but, like, that, that, that that's a firework all the way from the back. And Duxie for Tom. Taxi for Tom, we're going to Manchester for dim sum. So next stop, food. It is absolutely booming in here. Table for 12. Jesus, this is gonna be a feast. What's it called? Chasu. Chasu. It looks like a fluffy pudding, but when you open it up, oh, it's got meat in it. Film bow. I have, I, where, so, where's the kid, the dumpling? it ends up eating. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Look at it. Oh, that is, it. yeah, that is so nice. It's just very fucking hot. Wait, wait, this is, is this the intestine? No. This one? What is it? Cow intestine? Cow intestine and Oh, that looks disgusting. Wait, can I, can I show you this? Can I show you the texture of it? Wait, oh. <coughs> Spicy? Question mark? Just put it in. It's just really chewy. Have you tried it? Um, I think I've tried it, yeah. <laughs> nope. I think you've not had enough. I had that under my bowl. It's gone on the... Oh, what, you're not eating that? Uh, oh, no, you can't. Uh, some sort of yummy, rooty thing. Oh, you're looking at It's like a woolly mama. Yeah. It's very dry. You need to get into the filling of the middle. Yeah, a minute. Um, it's like a it's like a Chinese meat pie. Or a pasty or something. What is it? What is it? It's a lobster! That's a lot of that's a lot of lobster. What's it do? Snap snap snap! Oh mate, there's a Mean ass looking lobsters. We've got Ken up at the house. Look at him. He's fixing me defender. 
Oh, well, my, uh, my engine on my Defender started going dick, 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 the other day. Just after in the vlog, I was like, yeah, I'm going to go start it up, get it going again, because it's not like getting cold and stuff like that. It might start getting icy. want to be in the Defender. Well, the next day, just after me saying that in the vlog, that started happening. So we reckon the immobilizer went because the battery was dead. So let's investigate. Oh, it's windy. Alrighty. What's happening? What's we're happening? In. Oh, we're in. We're in? I guess <laughs> so, yeah. yeah, that's a that's a bonus. It, the car got that disabled. I know it sounds so stupid. The car got that disabled, right? That I couldn't even use a key to unlock it. Whoa, what have you done? Is that my battery? Yeah. How did you know that was there? Because that's the way that I know one over people. Go on, Ken, lad. Flat, Taught me something new. Yeah, so Do I just have to jump it? Or? I've got a machine to pick it up. Go on, Kenneth! Like, I, I say this a million and sixty-five thousand times, but like, it's so sad that like, me and the, the gener my next generation of mates, I don't have anyone I can call to like, yo, can you come and do this? Can you do that? Or can you help me with this? Whereas like, my dad, he can do everything. Build a wall, plumb, gas, cars, everything he can do. Can he fix it? We can fix it. Yes, he can. Right, let's do it. Do, do, do you like how I'm doing this in the rain? Flip flops on. Yep. Yeah, I don't know why I chose to do this, but I'm going to do it. Ooh, battery's back on. <laughs> ah! Turn your alarm off. Go on, lad. All right, look at that. Proper taught me something. Mate, if this ever happens again, I know what to do now. I'm well happy. What, go and buy one of that? Uh, yeah. <laughs> like, no, thank you. I really appreciate it. I never would have known. Go on. Is she dead? I messaged Jaguar, by the way, Land Rover, <laughs> and I asked them if I could take this down, rather than going to some third party company, take it down to the SVO team, which is Special Vehicles Operation Team, take it to them, um, and have and have them pimp it out, and uh, they're having a conversation on Monday, so. Oh, mate, mate, Ken showed me more about jack. this car than the person who sold me the car did, look. That's the wheel brace. A wheel brace, it. a jack, uh, a jack. That's for putting under wheel so it can roll in. Oh, really? Yeah, you get it out. Okay, this and is random. A clip there. Mate, There's I've a got... clip in there, you'll yeah, yeah. clip. That'll come comes out. With it, comes with a free jack. That stops the wheel from rolling when you jack it up. Nice. Oh, go on, Kenny boy. Look at that. How satisfying is that? Come on, isn't that satisfying? Get her clean. It it, it doesn't quite work. It doesn't look, but it's clean. It don't work, but it looks good. Yeah. <laughs> my, my dad just started it up. What did you say? Threaded it with an Audi. <laughs> right, if you don't piss in work, we will put an Audi on your ass. So, if you don't start, I'll, <laughs> I'll, I'll kick you with the Audi. I'll kick you with the Audi. If you don't <laughs> away, so it's gonna go, in. go on, that lad, let's get her going. Yo, look how dirty this side looks compared to the other side that we just washed. I think we left some soap on it, but that look already looks much cleaner. In my vlog, right, I said he'd put traps down to kill the moles. He's not put traps down to kill the moles. He's put down little windmills to make noise to scare them off. Mate, they've absolutely butchered this garden, right? So the moles used to go around that garden into hers, but then they dug up their garden, put a path down and stopped them from getting in. So now they just go, oh, mate, this is sick. I'm just chilling mine, so cheers, moles. Appreciate you. This is uh, getting your dad up to teach you how to run your house because my dad built the house, right? So he knows where everything is and all that sort of stuff because that was just a way whilst it was being built. So, oh my God, I just realized that's where he put all the firework stuff. Bloody hell, that's a lot of firework stuff. Uh, but because he built the bloody house, he, he literally has to teach me how to use things in my own house. Right, oh shit, man, broke the fucking gate. Right, will she start? Go again. Go and lid lid. Wait for it. Oh no, she just started. She not keep hold of it? Okay, so maybe we weren't going to hit it with the Audi and we thought we had hope, but now we've gone back to hitting it with the Audi. <laughs> oh shit, I just saw sparks come off it. Mm. Uh oh, what have you just done? No, <laughs> uh, replay that. Yeah. So we're going to attach the bad boy to the big boy. Oh, the other way around, I don't know. Uh, what the fuck? I feel, like, I, feel, I feel like he's missing something here. I feel like something's supposed to go in that hole. <laughs> Here we go, boys. I'm ready with the revs. I don't want it screaming. I don't want it revving like you did just yeah. dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. 
Okay, sweet. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Bloody hell, he's doing 168,000. Oh, kilometers. <laughs> Cheating. I'm waiting for the signal. I'm waiting for, I'm waiting for the signal. Give me a signal, Ken. Come on. Power it. Turn that beast on, Kenneth. Turn that beast on. Go on, lid. Go on, lid. Imagine if it accidentally went into gear and I just smacked the defender. I'm trying to not move my feet, but I'm wearing flip-flops. This is kind of a struggle. Just still, still, still revving. I keep going really high with the rev zone and I panic. And then I go really low, then I go really high. But he's still trying to get it going, but we think the immobilizer keeps kicking in and cutting out the engine, so... Yeah, we don't know. I don't, well, I don't think we know. I think Ken knows. But the battery's just so low that... We just don't know. Next stage of the plan, we're gonna go ahead because these batteries have been like lying around so long. Um, I can't see them being dead, but we're gonna go and get one more of these little uh, car sort of batteries. We're gonna get one of these from Garage Dark Road, and uh, we'll see if we can elim eliminate the problem of it being a dead fob. Um, you know, to not be able to turn the immobilizer off. So let's go find out. Went all the way to Tesco. Got the new ones. Not doing a fucking difference. Which one? Do you know which one does which? When it's this to one's unlocked. The central, lock, central locking. Yeah, that. And it didn't do it. No, that's supposed to unlock that right now, and it's not doing. But the thing is, when we open a door, the light's coming on. So it's working, but it seems like the, the locking system isn't working. Damn it! Hey, can I buy you some flowers to say thank you? <laughs> no, you got you got a monster. Not not sponsored, please sponsor. <laughs> See you later, Dad. Thanks for your help. Love you, buddy. Fucking hell. No avail, god damn it. Also, fun story. I do actually have my custom plate to put on it. I just need my logbook, take it down somewhere, get the, the, the license plate made and put it on. I, I, I own it, I just need to transfer it. Oh, on the successful day was unsuccessful. I can I? Shit. Now I'm locked out of the house and I've got full hands. Bollocks! Um, working with Orion here to work out a highlights montage for Syndicate Royale channel. We're about to hit 100k subs. And I'm pretty sure my computer's at one second. I'm, I'm literally having to use my foot because I'm recording at the same time. But I'm pretty sure my computer's about to blue screen. Uh, it's completely crashed. Oh dear. <laughs> 99,000. 1,000 subscribers away. From getting that plaque. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Time to do dinner right. Lydia's made cupcakes. We've got some mashed potato going in. D doesn't look like mashed potato, but it will be. We're having green beans and bacon and cream. Very nice. Sirloin for Lydia. Ribeye for myself. Oh, season time. Secret sauce. Garlic powder. Trust me. Well, secret sauce. This is like my key ingredient for flavouring. And then... Himalayan pink salt. Don't know the difference between pink and normal salt, but this shit's good. Oh, yeah, this is the music I decided I wanted to listen to. Oh, wait, I'm wasting water. This is the music I wanted to listen to whilst I was doing my steaks, but look at them. Ooh, ribeye looking seasoned, the salon looking good. I'm really happy with that. Gonna eat them and it's gonna taste good. Yeah, I can't sing, sorry, bye. Very proud with the seasoning on these steaks. We're gonna let them not sit in the fridge, but just absorb the flavor for like 10 minutes. Oh wait, I was gonna salt bay, but then I realized I've got no way of turning it at the same time. That works. Pause the cooking. He's just, he's just bloody turned up back at my house. Look at he's ki he's Kenneth. We do we doing back with a take two, eh? What's going on here? All right, what's the plan? Well, just give it a, we'll just give it a turn, but I think got. It's mm. definitely, in my opinion, it's definitely the immobilizer. It's just, it's the central locking. Yeah. Not really simply immobilizer. Oh, sorry. The locking. It's the central yeah. locking and the back and the alarm. It's this engagement of that. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Hey, it looks it looks shiny as hell. It might not work, but it looks clean. It keeps getting us every time we start it up. It goes. Oh, rip. Oh, oh, Ken, you've got no case on it. Oh, have you just done that? Oh, just done that. Yeah. Oh no, <coughs> Ken. <laughs> Wait, where are you? Hold, hold that for a second. Just point at me. Oh, yeah, see here. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> see here. It's bad, is it? 
Shout out to Kenneth again. He got me these lovely steak knives. Look at the... Oh, we got that Robert Welsh, uh, if that's how you say it. Because, can I just show you this over there? This is uh, Robert Welsh, the nicest uh, knives ever. Um, the reason why they look a bit, like, colourlessly not black is because uh, I put them in the washing machine and you're not supposed to do that. Uh, but, look at those. Oh, tell me you're not excited to cook. cook. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. I can fucking see myself in them. I see dead people. But yeah, shout out to my dad. Thanks for that. Uh, dad and Gail got me some nice uh, steak knives uh, for that. And also, guys, the secret sauce. S-A sauce. If you have never tried this, buy it online now. I think they sold out, actually. But buy it. Use um, double... They, they sell out of this stuff all the time. Like, it's that popular. Yeah, they just want this one out of the I'm gonna buy it all out so no one else can have it. I'm gonna buy the company. SA Sauces, I'm gonna buy it and sell it. I'm gonna rename it renaming it to SO instead of SA, Syndicate Original Sauce. Oh, oh, this is one that I left open by accident, so yeah, it's not supposed to look like that. Um, oh, it smells, so good. It smells so good. Let, let, let me find a different one. Oh, look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Oh. My mouth is watering. I think we've done amazingly. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh, this, yo, that steak, so juicy. My steak, look, oh dudes, the, the, oh, the juice I just pulled off it and put into this. Um, I don't actually have um, a sauce pot. Thanks, Alice, appreciate that. She stole that off me. Uh, but look at this, we got, we got corn on the cob, we got uh, green beans and bacon, we got mashed potato with a huge piece of garlic in it that I'm definitely gonna extract before I have smelly, smelly breath, but it this. It feels sweeter when you cook it. Okay, then. It, this looks amazing. Right, I'm gonna go for a steak taste, taste test on mine. Oh, I nailed that medium. I nailed that medium on my steak. Oh, I'm very happy with that. Oh, look at that, are you ready? Good. Let me take a picture of mine first. That's pretty good. Right, wait, 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 wait. Oh, what about my sauce? What about my sauce? With my mushrooms in by accident. <laughs> I mean, totally meant to do that. <laughs> Look at that sauce. Oh, Look at that sauce. Custom made. It's not even the full SA uh, sauce, by the way. It's mine. Because I, cust I customise it myself with a few little ingredients. But let's go for a taste test with, with sauce. And she's just Instagramming. Oh my God, that's incredible. Well happy with that. What about my veggies? Oh. That tastes so healthy. So healthy. <laughs> Green beans gone super fat mode with bacon. Delicious. Oh, and the potatoes. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that steak. You said medium, right? Yeah. Oh, look, oh, nailed that. I've nailed that. It's so soft. Is it? Is it good? Mm -hmm. Dad did good. Mm -hmm. I think I might have cooked that one the best yet, actually. Oh, look at it. Totally biased. Say it right now. 10 out of 10. <laughs> 10 out of goddamn 10. This is probably the first time I've actually cooked oh, my steak perfectly and Lydia's doing like you know more than once at a time. I've got corn on cob, I've got mashed potatoes, I've got potatoes that I don't usually have with a meal. I usually have that shitty veg. Mm -hmm. And it's just... Look on my finger. Oh my nose man. There's a big fly in my hat. There's a big fly in my house. I don't know where it came from, but you just need to die. They're huge. I, yeah, There's I really don't. I don't know where they're coming from. I think someone. I think something died in my house, oh. and I don't know where it is. You are. This fly needs. Fuck off! <laughs> Look, it almost looks not real how I've caught it, but I went like that in the air and grabbed it. Didn't I? Yeah, it's alive. It's just stunned. I didn't. I haven't damaged it. I haven't hurt it. If I let it go, yeah, it'll fly off. Don't go outside. I actually caught it. Look, <laughs> the detail on it. It's not dead at all in the slightest, guys. I j Whoa, it's bums well, but I've just got it by the leg, and I stunned it with a waft. Look at it. That is genuinely beautiful. If it flies off, I'll be sad because then that way it's back in my. All right, then, mate. I'm trying to eat dinner. Saving that. For, save it, saving that for later. What? Go on. Uh, give you hundred quid if you eat it now. Oh, I didn't have I'll give you 100 quid if you eat it. I don't need 150 quid. quid. I'll give you 200 quid if you eat it. No, thank you. What about 300? No. Four? Imagine you pay for my visa. 500? I'm okay. You want to eat that fly for 500 quid? Would you? No. <laughs> Get lost. Right, I'm going to go free him. Like Freedom! No, I'm sure you wouldn't. Like, I'm pretty sure we have acids in there and stuff to avoid fly stomachs. Stomach flies. Stomach maggots or whatever. 
Right, come on, mate. Please don't be dead. This would be really awkward. Okay, mate. Freedom! Oh, wait. Oh, we actually flew off! Go on, lad! I saw him fly away! Have a great life! Bye-bye now! Look at that! An amicable breakup! That was brilliant! I'm gonna I'm gonna come clean. Genuinely thought I'd killed it. That's why it wasn't moving. I did think it was still alive because I only wafted it. I just knocked it out like dazed it. And when I dropped it, I thought it was gonna go in and die. Flew off. Did my deed for the day. Ooh, ooh. Don't mind me. Just having a dessert of a home oh took his arm off already. A homemade gingerbread man from Lydia. Oh what's that? Terry's chocolate orange pants. Mmm, don't mind if I do. Hello vlog, I look bright red and all excited and happy and everything like that because live on my first stream, like my first game, first stream of, of the day, I was like, yo, I'm like a thousand subscribers away from hitting 100k on Syndicate Royale. Whipped on the stream and what did we do? We got 100,000 subscribers live whilst hitting a W. Oh, we did it. First win, 100k all at once. Oh! Oh! Baby. Come. So Guys. She made me a cupcake with a... Oh! Well done. She made me a cupcake with 100,000 subscribers on it. Oh! 100,000 subscribers. Whoa, 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 whoa. Leg slap! Ladies and gentlemen, it is a mon Monday, 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 morning! I'm pretty sure my shouting just set off my Alexa. Lydia's gone because she's going to be having a hectic ass week. She's getting ready because if you guys didn't know, she's going traveling. She's going, uh, uh Vietnam. I don't know, I just made up like she's basically going traveling Asia. So while she's going traveling all Asia, she's gotta get visas sorted, she's gotta get bags packed and all that sort of stuff. Um so while she's packing bags, um I'm moving the dominoes that I've left in my room for over uh well I could say I left in the room, you know, it's a team effort. Lydia did eat it as well, but uh, the dominoes that's been left in the room for over uh, like four days, three days, three days, three days now. Yeah, I think I should put it in the bin so uh this is not a bad looking day actually, you know, like the sun's trying to come out, there's a few clouds in the sky, so it's all not bad, it's not bad. Don't worry gaming setup, soon, soon I'll be there. Oh mate, this red hot sauce is totally falling off the edge, don't you dare, stay there you little shit. No, no, thank you. Alright, um, I need a cup of tea, I need to then go back to my office and start my day. But I think, yeah, you know I've got no pants on, yeah I'm going to go outside like this, balancing this so. Wish me luck. Chop the hot sauce. Boom! Fun fact, you can't actually recycle, you can't, can't actually recycle um, a pizza box. And if you're like, oh, why? It's cardboard. Uh, true story, spoke to the bin men, and they were like, yeah, well, no, it just gets thrown away because of all the pizza and food remains stuck to it. We just chuck it, and I was like, oh, I did not know that. So, the more you know. So much of me wishes that you could just burn things and it wasn't bad for the environment. Obviously, I know, you know, putting the, the carbon dioxide in the air and the CO2 levels and all this sort of shit. Now, I know you're not supposed to do it, but I love fire. I used to love fire when I had a flamethrower, ripperoni, pepperoni. I know, I know, I'm a pyromaniac, but starting today, well, this is the wrong one. Starting today off with a cup of tea. And if you've ever seen how to make a cup of tea as fast as me, watch this, you ready? Super fast cup of tea. Wait for the get kettle to boil, Sight. Instant hot water. Look, you see this? Like, th look at that. You ready? You ready? It's pretty much done. It's done. Just have to stir it, put some sugar in, some milk in. Don't even have to wait for it to boil. First game of the day. Come on now. Have you have you got your cake? Have you got your have you got your pan? Um, this was the most efficient way I could think of carrying these cakes. Like, come on. It's look. They don't move. It's genius. They're not going to get squished, they're not going to get dinked at anything, and you, you little rascal of a dog. This little rat boy, oh my god, you look, you look, your colours look amazing, Stephen, look at that. Wow, you look beautiful, dude. I'm going to go pick you up some food now, because I know you've run out. Look, wow, that is a, that's a nice looking dragon, that. That's Game of Thrones material right there, I love you. 
All right, Stephen, with a, you, by the way, for people who don't know, you spell Stephen, S-T-E-E-V-E-N. St- sorry, bud, Stephen. So we're gonna go get him some food right now from Swell, and then we're gonna go get some food and have a family cupcake dinner. <laughs> so bye, St- oh, Steve didn't get a cupcake. Damn it, we need to change that. Ooh, what have they got in stock today? Oh, oh, whoa, what are you? What is this little guy? A Aki monitor. Whoa. He's pretty active. Wow, like that. Oh, whoa. Look at this geese. One day, one day I will have you, man. Look at him. He's trying to get freedom. Just going to say, you probably won't escape anytime soon. And the, the thing is, they are in here, but I just don't know where. A Jackson chameleon with horns. Can you see him? Where? Can, can anyone actually see him? Or is there actually nothing in here? If someone can locate him, screenshot him me, and tweet him me. Oh, he's there. Whoa. Oh, that was a good camel, that. Time to feed Steve. Where the food at? Where, where the... Oh, there. Oh, yes, they've got loads in stock. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, no. I really can't believe it. Sorry, there's my fun for the day. Ta-da. All right, got Steve some food. I've got to go to the bakery and get the potatoes. But also, before then, I've got to get some coffees for the team. Um, but there's a stretch hummer outside Starbucks. Wicked. Looks like there's a wedding going on in here. Oh, are you kidding me? There's two stretch limos, and apparently it's a big fat gypsy wedding. So, yeah, the, like all the bridesmaids, I thought were actually like you know the, the all the I thought it was the bride. I was like almost gonna say congratulations to her, but then I saw someone else wearing the same dress. But it was massive. So they're going they're going big or going home. You you fucking dare! You dare do that! Wait, wait oh my god! I lost my door. Right, am I, am I safe yet? No, no. <laughs> Don't you fucking... <laughs> Wait, I haven't put my... What? <laughs> Wait, I need to put my handbrake on. All right. Fuck it, I'm fucking have you. Hey, I forgot... I only gave you one last week. I came back to bring you two. Fucking give me my potatoes! Don't you dare tell my mother. Four potatoes, please. Four potatoes, please. Where's the present? Oh, fucking... Oh, shit. Yeah. I already told it right there! <laughs> right, if you can guess what's in this pan, you can have it. Mum? Nice haircut, Mum. In what? In this pan? Nice haircut, Mum. A frog. Nice hair, Mum. Uh, frog? Why? No different. Oh, oh I dyed it after what See? Thank you. A frog. I knew it changed. No, what, what's, if you can guess what's in the pan, a you can have it. Oh. A frog. Oh. A frog. Oh. A mouse! You could eat it. Uh, a rat! How about cupcakes? Oh, come on! I was expecting. How the fuck am I gonna catch a rat in a pan? I don't know. I'm sorry, but what the heck? Mum, what? Mum. Oh, yeah, I have actually been to swell. Bless your face. I'm going to London for Visa China. Who's going to China? Lydia. She's going to Shanghai to see her sister, and I might be going as well at the end of the trip. Oh. You did dye your hair, and aren't you proud of your son for noticing? What? Are you not proud of me for noticing your hair got done? Yeah. Oh, wait, pause, we're doing it. Who's the next order? It's sealed, that one. No, oh, you have to go the, the next, next one. Next order. Quick, load uh, it. Dean Oxborough. Dean, what's he ordered? What's Dean ordered? Oh, Dean. He's oh, Dean. Protection this year. Oh, Dean. A medium coat Dean. of arms t shirt. Throw him in another t shirt and a wristband. No, I won't. Throw him in. Alice. Mum. Why should I give him a t shirt? Alice. Make her do it. No. Right. You know, if you were to say something like, just give him wristband, she'd do it. Why would you do it? I'm wristband? the boss. Why would you give someone a t shirt? I am the boss. Alice, please, please, can you do it? I brought you food! Like I'm trying to be nice to the viewers! She's, she's queen packing, aren't they? Right, listen, you're getting an extra t-shirt and you're getting a wristband. Final. Uh, what the fuck are you doing? Wheel spinning off my drive, you crank. Jesus, boof! I thought he was going to hit the post. Whoa, oh, mate, that panned out so well. I've been running around all, all day, well, so far. Getting the food, getting the potatoes, getting the drinks and all that. Only to just get into my house, put the stuff down, and the controller stuff came. Now, if you don't know what I've got... Uh, oh, God, one sec. I'll go get my controller. Tell you what, we'll, we'll just take it all to the office. Fuck it. We're going. We're going back to the office. Oh, my God. Talk about a fiasco. I've, I, I missed that package last Friday. And I was like, no! Because I just needed... Uh, this thing, because let me show you what it is. It's my scuff controller, right? This thing is a beast. Now, the reason why the controller is so good, right, is when you're gaming, you've got all these buttons on the front, but when you're pressing this button or that button, it can move your finger from the sticks that you need to use. So it's got paddles on the back like this, but 
as you can see, I've pressed this button so many times there that look, I've wore it down to the plastic. So because I know, um, because I know Duncan, the CEO of Scuff, I hit him up and like just texted him and was like with a voice and I was like, bro, I'm playing Blackout that much that I've worn away my controller. I got food for Steve as well, nice. Uh, that I've worn away my controller. And um, it was like, don't worry, I'll first class ship you some like next day delivery. And he did, but because it was a Friday, the next day they could try and deliver it was bloody, um, bloody today, because I missed it. So, right, next stop, back to the office where I can now sit, chill, and have some food. Oh my God, bloody hell, I am so happy that package came. Duncan, scuff, thank you. I needed that, man. The, like pressing, I've been constantly pushing this button, and I've basically just been pressing a piece of hard metal which has been horrible. It's been proper hurting my finger because I've just, I've got no thumbstick left. That's how much I've been gaming on Syndicate Royale. I've got no thumbstick. Okay. Oh no, I just put cake sap on the top of my bloody thing. Right. God, I'm, wait, I need to show you in the, in the reflection what I'm carrying. A bag of potatoes, a box, a muffin and a coffee. Hello. Hi, mum. You all right there? Why are you still walking around with food in the bag? Because I brought it back to eat, you crank. I've just got to open this box. Oh shit, my potato. <laughs> What's my potato? All right, Scuff Gaming. Hey Tom, it was great to catch up with you this week. Here's a few sets of Scuff thumbsticks to use <laughs> over the next couple of weeks. I shall be in touch with you next early to discuss plans for future partnership together really for 2019. It's going to be an exciting yoon. You, you, yeah. <laughs> Speak soon, Dunk, hashtag Team Scuff. Duncan, you're a legend. I met Duncan when he, before, this oh, this controller company is worth so much money. Like, they're, they're a fantastic company. I met them when they were in, like, prototype phase at an oh, event. So now, look at my thumbstick. Yeah. Look how wore down it is, right? Let me show oh, you. Oh, this what... is yours? Yeah, look. This is what it's supposed to look like, wow. this. Right, ready? So, get, wait, get past it here. Watch. You guys, that's that's what mine looks like. That's what it's <laughs> supposed to look like. Don't don't worry about, like, it being an indented shape. Look at the difference. I finally got new thumbstick. There you go. That's what that's what mine's that's what mine's supposed to look like. It comes brand new. Guys, it comes brand new like this. Mine looks like that. Look how worn down that is. Oh my god. Dude, scuff hooking it. Oh, Duncan, thank you, brother. I appreciate that. What else did you send me? Oh I got I got them. Oh the different size ones. What oh he sent me two He sent me three sets of them because he knows I'm gonna like go through them all dude duncan thank you so much brother i appreciate it and a, and a sticker hashtag team, team scuff but no seriously um we might be working with scuff on some really cool shit like really cool shit just saying i am performing you, you seem actually better now that you've eaten food were you just hungry i think you were just hungry before weren't you you were just hungry, weren't you? I put the washing machine. Oh, stress. Right, ladies and gentlemen, I've removed the old thumbstick. By the way, look, that's that's what mine looked like, and that's what the new one looks like. This, this, this actually turned into that. Look, look, just look at that difference. Look at that difference. Looks like he's made of two different materials. No, it came like that. I just wore it down and melted it. Think of how many times I pressed it. I get it. You game a lot. I'm um, eight. I hit hundred thousand subscribers on the Royale channel. Oh, can we do a ten percent off code again? Yeah. Well, can we? Can we wait? So can we do one hundred k, one zero zero k, being the code? The moment this vlog yeah. goes live, one zero zero k, and that is ten percent off everything Syndicate Original. Okay. Yeah. Yes. That guy is getting a free T-shirt. You're gonna embarrass yourself because when he phones, she's she, she, she not got the cups since she left, so just go and get it. It's on the laptop. Please. Why are you looking at me? Please. She's the boss. I took over recently. I threw a fork over at her. Christmas. Fuck she, you. She took over in November. As the CEO? No, temporary standing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now completing the final thing. Wait, is it, is, it, is it on? Is this on? How do I put it on? I don't want to break it. Okay, just to make sure mum has indeed put two t-shirts in there. Thanks, mum. I don't mom. know why I did. <laughs> All right, there you go, dude. You got your two t-shirts. <laughs> they just hate you. They're like, yeah, give a wristband away, but stop giving away all our stuff. I'm like, it's mine. I can do it. <laughs> what? I can do it. It's yours in name only. It's mine in name only. Yeah, okay, guys. Don't forget 10% discount if you use 100K. So 100K. Do it. All right. So the long problem of visas starts again now. 
Lydia is going traveling Friday and she's going all around like Asia and stuff like this with the best mate. They've planned it for ages. Now I'm going to go join them in Shanghai at the back end of the journey. But I need, try just let yourself in. Uh, I need a visa, so does Lydia. So to get a visa, we can't go to the consulate in Manchester. We have to go to London. So we're going to go down to London, but I need to send off my application form. And before I send off my application form, I need a flight. So I need to book a ticket to China. Context, for sending off for this visa, right, for us to go down there, you need to submit a photo with a white background. That's what we did. This is the first photo we took. So then of which Lydia was like, mm, it's probably not going to be white enough, so we'll change it. So we changed it to a bit more white, all right? Pretty white. Whiter background. That didn't get accepted. We then increased, like, the whiteness on it to that. <laughs> I don't know if this picks up on camera. Your beard's green. And then, yeah, I've got a green beard almost, and that got accepted. What? Oh, don't qualify it. No way. All right, he should just be there. There he is. Come in. Hey, mate. Oh, look at you with chops. Gravy on your chops. Are you just having your dinner, mate? Yeah. Brilliant. What are you having? A curry. A curry? That's yeah. nice. Look what I've got for you. Oh, nice. Look what, look what I've got for you. What? Lydia, Lydia's major, a coconut cupcake. Oh, yeah. Are you can't eat your dinner first, you crank. No. <laughs> I don't like it. Oh, you don't like it? No. We'll try and get some of it in you though, otherwise you'll be starving later, won't you? How is it? No. Is it nice? No. Hey, look, I've got one as well. <laughs> well, I meant to give you this a long time ago, but this is something a fan drew. Who's that? Can you, do you need your glasses? I think you need glasses. It yeah, it's you. Put your glasses on. There you go. Look, someone drew that by hand, and it's you and me. Good, isn't it? Really good, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, fashion. That's a gift for you. It's for you. Yeah. There you go. Good job I remembered to check if I had everything. About to go down to London. Left the bloody passport that I was scanning in the scanner, didn't I? You silly goose, you didn't give it me, did you? She stapled up my papers together all nice and neat, but what did she give me back? It's almost like you didn't want me to go. Oh my god, I was sat home streaming playing Blackout and I was like, it's getting a bit late. We got a train to catch at 8.23. It's 8.21. And the taxi driver, I was like, bro, get us there fast. <laughs> I'll tip you. And he did the speed limit properly. That's why I paid him an extra tenner. But on his clock on the dash, it was two minutes quick. So we were like, <laughs> but I didn't tell Lydia it was running quick. <laughs> Just so the guy kept going fast, the uh, normal speed. So we got here, and we made it. We made it, 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 London, Houston. No, that's the biggest pork pie I've ever, it's a pork pie, isn't it? It's got chicken, it's got chicken, duck fat, bacon, pork. It is nice, isn't it? Almost like a chutney. Mmm. That is good. We made it to London. We actually, we actually, made, we actually made the train. I don't know. We don't know how we managed that. What were your, what, what chance did you actually think? 20% chance? No, I thought only. I, I would have given us a 25. Mm. I was feeling confident 50% chance. I was feeling 50%. But then we got stuck behind a bus. No, oh, lights. So no, we took over a bus, but then the, the bus got back in front of us, and I was like. This is it, Chief. It was definitely the lights to me because those lights they gave just the Oh, yeah. But we've made it to London, so we're going over to our friend Jenny's house. And we're going to Jenny, who you've seen with basically Jenny, whose boyfriend's the drunk Irish guy. Yeah, that guy. So we're going, staying at their house. And unfortunately, Eamon's not here, he's in Amsterdam. We're going to stay with them. And then in the morning, we're going to get up nice, bright, and early to go to the Shanghai region. Chinese consulate. Yeah, Chinese consulate. Um, to go and get our visas, so. Yeah, let's. Yeah, I don't, I don't. I don't know how I thought that was going to work, but yeah, well, basically, we're going to go to the Shanghai Indian Embassy and get ourselves some visas. Woo! And then what we're going to do? I don't know, actually. It's that. Oh, yeah. Or Harry Potter. Oh, no, that's amazing. No, if we could do spa, spa would be good. We need to go to a spa. Or a show. Matinee. Let's find a spa. Do it. We got on at Houston, okay, and usually when you get on the tube, you probably only go like a few stops, but we're going all the way from Houston, all the way to Collier's Wood over there. So, what, one, one, two, 
3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 stops, bloody hell. This is, this is officially the longest ride on a tube in one go of ever. Well, you've done this one before. Uh, okay, I may have done it before, but I never paid attention to how bloody far it was. 16 hours later, we finally made it. <gasps> Airbnb. <laughs> Hello. And just like that, we're out by 8.02. That's pretty successful for us, to be fair. Good morning, little weed. Good, good morning. <sighs> yeah, let's talk, let's talk about that. So basically, Lydia's going to do the traveling and she's going to Shanghai. I'm also going to go to Shanghai at the end of their trip and just join up with them, meet up with them and have a good little week out in Shanghai and see, see what's the two out there. Now, whilst they're out in Shanghai, the plan is to be staying with Lydia's sister, B, who's currently working out there at Disney. But... You have to have a, like a letter of notice from them. To like, say you that you can stay them. Yeah, like this is your confirmation of staying. Now to do that, um, a sister has to go to the building, basically, owners, and go, yep, I need this letter of confirmation to say that this person can stay from England at my property. Um, and Lydia's got that, but because I jumped on last minute onto the trip, um, I don't have that. I text the last night, but that time's a difference. So when we went to bed, she was still in, in bed, and then by the time she'd woken up and replied with all the stuff she needed, we were asleep. So we missed each other completely. And basically we woke up to the fact that she won't be able to get us this documentation that we need. So I'm gonna to have to go online, book a hotel, which- I don't think which... this is a hack, you know. No, no, I'm not gonna say that. I'm gonna to have to go online, book a hotel, which is then gonna give me a confirmation email of being like, this is where you're staying. And then hopefully at the consulate, I'll be like, this is where I'm staying. And uh, that's that, let's, let's hope plan B works. London underground, London underground, because oh my god, this is really quiet and I'm being really loud, so let's try this again. London underground, London underground. Didn't know you were a turtle. Nice bag, yo. <laughs> the size of that thing. Ooh, very British. Welcome to England. We have made it to bank wow would you look at this just look at it look how look uh it feels like doesn't it feel like you're in harry potter right now look at how many people there are there's like only two cars inside and look at that that's the underground that looks well cool yeah we're going to the ministry of magic all right i think we're going this way we're thinking that's where we need to go oh no no nope, that's just the bank of china oh. damn it the chinese visa application Your service destination center is on the left woman shut up what time is it? 9.43, nailed it. Okay, we had a problem though. So I went in and gave my documents and so the woman's going through it, going through it, going through it. And Alice stapled them all together. And on the bottom of the page, it said like one of one of eight and it was one to eight. And then the other one was like one of three, one to three. And I was like, okay, cool. But the woman was like, where's the first page? I was like, what? She was like, the application form, where is it? Like, where's the first page with the barcodes on it? And I knew what she was talking about, but it was impossible for it to not have printed off because on the bottom of the page is printed, it was like one, two, three. So it made no sense for it to not be there, but lo and behold, it didn't actually print off. So luckily Lydia had some changes in the computer there we could log into and do it, but. And we printed it off 55 times since the printer wasn't working. So yeah. it took all my change. No, 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 no. Yeah. Numbed our cash, but yeah, that was a bit of a, but she was just like, yeah, just go print it off, come back, you're fine. So if you ever go down to the thingy to print off your, uh, not print off the thing, if you ever go to get a visa, from that place. Actually, it's so actually helpful. pretty smooth. They're not dickheads or anything like that. And it's quite good, so I approve of I approve of China. Good good job, China. Wow. Okay, this is really busy. Oh, it's packed. Oh no no no. Again, because we've done all the touristy stuff in London, what do me and Lydia do? We go to hotels and go for spas. So we're at the Mandarin Hotel. I'm going for a spa. Where would you like your pressure? In my head where I've been wearing my headset, my hands where I've been gaming, and my calves just because they hurt. <laughs> we made it to the spa, and this is how you know it's the men's changing rooms, not the women's. That's the women's, some boobs in a bush, and that's the men's. Nice one, bud. Oh my god, look how worn down it is from people touching it. Nice. 
think I'm the only person here, hopefully. There's a bubble spa all to myself. Nice. Not too sure what this says, it's guidelines or something, but apparently, whoa, this is like a steam room experience. Cool, definitely going in there. All right, I've got 30 minutes. Let's get in there, let's get in the sauna and chill out. Yo, this might be the fanciest spa I've ever been to. Look at that. You get a free wooden comb. Hell yeah. Okay. Oh. Okay, it started. Oh my God. That's intense. Oh man. That was a good massage. An hour and 20 minutes of just pure heaven. She was like, any particular areas? I was like, where my headset's been, where I've been gaming, and just everywhere else. But, oh my gosh, my hands. My hands feel like new. I don't appreciate that at all. No. I'm in the like, after spa relaxment room with a nice tea and a stress ball, which apparently I'm allowed to keep, so you better know I'm keeping these blue balls with you. But yeah, please, please, please don't go off again. That was scary. Back to squeezing my blue ball. Mm. I think that was an amazing decision. That was an amazing decision. Nine out of 10. Nine out of 10, why you're reasoning. Why only nine? Why only nine? Just because you stress ball. Okay, I was stealing. I was gonna steal those stress balls, which we, you could actually take, by the way, just saying, so I wasn't gonna steal them. But, no, because we couldn't. We can't fit through the, no, the, 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 rela time. the relaxing room. We couldn't sit together, you know, like in the hot tub and stuff together. Yeah. If we could have done that, that'd have been 10 out of 10. So, you what? I feel like a new person. I feel good. I feel good. Now, it was like, oh, what are we hungry for? We're gonna try and go and do afternoon tea. I oh, know. We're gonna try and do afternoon tea, but it's like finicky times. So, we're going. It's apparently a really nice restaurant. And we're getting sushi, motherfuckers. Hey! It's, it's, like, it's, it's like, yeah, yeah, I know, right? Dress code. It's like the perfect food sushi for me for like, is this underground? Oh, there it is. Nice bridge. Hey. It's like the perfect food for me because like when I don't want to have like a big meal or look like cakes at afternoon tea and shit like that, it's just fish, it's light, it's rice, it's nice, but it fills you up. So next up, what's it called? Sushi Samba. Sushi Samba. We are so close and then in other news which i can't talk about because it's super super secret to do with jaguar mm -hmm. something may be happening but the dates of the happening have just completely clashed with shanghai now as much as i love them shanghai comes first like it truly does so i'm going to shanghai and then when i get back some i can't say anything but something may be happening Whoa, look at this. Whoa, look at that. This is well nice. Oh, what a view. Flipping heck. That's cool. Lydia, I've, I've been to these. I've been to these in Japan. Yeah, wow. This is amazing. Pretty good spot. That is a pretty mega restaurant. Oh my Lord. Sushi time, boys. Can I just interrupt? I just looked at the menu, right? Kobe, Kobe beef is A thousand pounds for a kilogram of it. Oh, no way. I'd love to say we're having a really nice meal, but then when I look up, I've just got this red light in the background on top of that crane, just blinding me. Yeah, you're definitely gonna show us how you do it. We were all showing Jenny how to use these and the guy came over with the uh, children's chopsticks, but <laughs> shrimp, ten te te shrimp tempura for a starter. It's too, too small. It's too hot. <laughs> oh. mm. Shrimp tempura. Tempura, amazing. The calamari. Very sweet. What's that? This is this the wagyu? The uh, wagyu gyoza smells incredible. Oh, this food's starting to warm my belly now, but we like it. I like it, right? I'm going in. I'm going in, boys. You ready? Committing to it. That's incredible. Wow. <laughs> It, 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 is your mouth not watering? Yeah. Blackened cod. Oh my gosh! Right, I'm going. I'm going. I'm going for the ruining of it. I'm going. Going in. Get it. The first bite. Oh, it melts. It's like butter. 
That is, so, dude, that is so good. We're devouring this. That, by the way, I'm saying this right now. That's a 10 out of 10 dish. Yeah? That is 10 out of 10. However, it does have popcorn on it. Not too sure why, but sure. 10 out of 10. And now I'll try the lamb chops. That's pretty incredible. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Wow. The lobster maki. Oh, mate. Uh, apparently, we've got one of the infinity stones here as a piece of ice. Comes with caviar. Wait, what does this say? Oh, is that the lid? Sushi samba. Uh, comes with uh, part of a tree and some lobster rolls. Nice. I'm attempting the lobster roll. That is very, very flavorful. The truffle. Fuck, oh, oh, that, that, but it's really nice. Oh my gosh, that's, nah, that's well nice. Oh, that's a flavor explosion, that. I can taste like six different things at once. Oh. Not exactly a bad place to wash your hands. Look at that view. That is awesome, look at it. London looks magnificent. Come on now, welcome to Japan. Look how cool this is. I used to know what these were called because Tomiru taught me, but I forgot. <laughs> Very cool, right? Oh my God, you look terrifying. Oh my God. So that's where we just ate and then next door, look at that. I don't know what this building is, but look at that fish tank. That's incredible! Look, the Mora eels there. Big snaky looking things. Wow. Mate. It's busy. It's rather busy. <laughs> Coffee bagged. Snacks bagged. Next up, PlayStation to Manchester. How did you enjoy your trip to London? I really enjoyed it. Was it was good, wasn't it? I actually did as well. That was well good. Hours. See, I like that though. I love trips where it's like go in, do something, come out. Like it's the best thing ever. And there it is, there it is. There's our train ready for us to take us home. The, hey, platform nine and three quarters. No. Go on, run at the wall. Okay. Go. <laughs> if you did, I'd love you. But you would be stupid. <laughs> so me. I'm joking. Um thus, like that. We're home. Oh, wow, that was really sharp on it. Wow. Scuffy streaming and Hex is in the background. Hopefully he gets better soon. And when he gets better, we're going to record a drift soon. Starting today with a granddad and a sister. Hello, guys. If you just look it up, you can see me. Okay, we're not doing that, I guess. Good evening. No, morning. Afternoon to your faces. It is currently... Uh, what day is it? What day is it? Where's the gold? Back with Sanchez. How do you, mate? Monday, yeah. Is it Monday? Wednesday. Wednesday. It feels like a Monday to me as well, to be fair. I don't have that. Okay. Lydia! The house has been invaded by small gingerbread men! How good do they look? So good. Are they ready? Chocolate. Well, they've, I don't think... I don't, yeah, well, what? I don't think they've gone hard yet. I want it wet. That's for you. How good are them gingerbread men? Oh. Do you want gingerbread man? No, we're going for dinner. We're going for dinner. You can have a gingerbread man yeah, when you get back. Yeah, no, Naughty. Gordon gazes on the landscape. Nope. Gordon gazes on the horizon and sees his jaguar. Jaguar. Guess what? I got some news. What? <laughs> jaguar. Ooh. J just, just for the record, try and get in it. Yeah, I'm really It's like a childproof <laughs> box. It is actually really hard to get into. I love Alice that. just wants a. Oh, you're in. Oh, they look good, don't they? They are good. They are good. Oh, you're a star. How'd you like your flowers, Lydia? Oh, did you get you some flowers? Yeah, I got her some flowers because I'm a romantic cutie. Yeah. Okay, bye, Alice. Bye, Alice. What? When you get me back from the cow. Yeah, well. What time do you need to be back for? And I will make sure you're back for that time. No, the... I don't know if you know, but. We need to make sure we put that 100k discount code on. It's on, doesn't it? It's active now? Yeah. Okay, well, I haven't, I haven't put the vlog out yet, I so if you're watching it. Yeah. Okay. Bye, Alice. Can I tweet it? Can I tweet it? Can I tweet it? Can I tweet it?
That's what you. Yes. Bye now. See you. See you another day. Bye bye now. Guess what? Already got three wins of blackout this morning. Dab on those haters, Alice. Go and dab on them, Alice. Do a triple dab. One. Hey, do a mini dab. Look, look, look. This is a mini dab, Alice. <laughs> Dabbing's dead. Bye. Ah yes. Countryside sheep and shit. We've made it to Linefield Garden Centre, which would just be the right. This is, listen to the dream. Lydia wants a bakery. Alice wants a tea and room. Yeah. I buy this. I buy this, and then Alice and Lydia do a tea room and a bakery. I buy the factory over there to just do my WTF whatever's I want in. Perfect, right? There's a bunch of houses here that I could buy as well, and then you know just move my entire family onto it. So it's like the the. The, the close everyone to get could get together for meals at the in the evening and stuff like that and then look at all that land for adventures so much room for activities Ooh, look at this plate oh look at these meat cuts <sighs> saucy just saying this right now that is the best cheese in the entire world snowdonian black bomber boom all right we're going for dinner where are they they are there hey do you reckon i'm gonna win it Fifty thousand pound tournament what are your motivating words for me? Go, Tommy. Go, Tommy. <laughs> All right, Granddad, I'll do it just for you. <laughs> Wait, order a water? I order a latte. You're drinking beer? <laughs> Mate, <laughs> it's two o'clock in the afternoon. It's exactly two o'clock, can you believe that? Hey, and people wonder where I get my drinking from. You. Show me what's in your hand now. Show me what's in your hand. Spit it out. You're not supposed to eat sugar cubes. He's drinking a beer and he's eating sugar cubes. Healthiest diet. That's probably not good for your diabetes, that is it? A beer and sugar. You can tell he's been stuck in hospital for a while, can't you? <laughs> I'll just wash that sugar cube down with a bit. Oh, look at that. That's a bit better than the toasty I had down in London yesterday. Look at look at the size of those chips. The size of that potato. And Grandad's going for a pie. Just like that. Bag myself some dinner for tomorrow night, Grandad. Sirloin steak. How are you doing? Oh, right. You pulling your bloody teeth out? No. Oh. Guy coming. You're not coming, it's a date night for me and Lydia, bugger off. Oh. Yeah, attention seeker. But I, was, I wish we could do the uh, meat slap thing, but I can't because it doesn't sound the same. Nope, neither does that. Oh, just, just imagine how cool it would be. You could make as much noise and do whatever you wanted out here. All this land to just roam and have fun with. It's just the one thing that annoys me so much, it's like, as, as people, we're like ants, we're like, we take this house and this is my little place where I I stay and I, I live in this hole, like this, that's it. Whereas it's like, there's all these rules and regulations that you can't just go and tear up a field or something like that because either someone owns it or it's, you know, the, the, the government and the green belt and all that sort of stuff. And I'm like, I just want to be free to do what I want when I want. To do that, I need land. And lots fucking of it. Mm. <laughs> I fucking got you! I got you, you slug! Oh, Teamwork! <laughs> you fucking flinched! Oh, you fucking flinched! Sluggy slug, I got you! You see, I don't mind the sound of Carl, like, raging through the house. I really, I really don't. But I can't see Lydia appreciating Carl screaming through the house. He hasn't, where is she? Hello? I think she's in there. So, I don't think she appreciates it, because while she's trying to sit and watch her show, all she can hear is, pay attention, listen. Oh, I was going to say he's quiet for a second, but that's him just at normal volume talking. Imagine when he's screaming after he gets killed in a game. He rages. I know Steve is loud. You shut this fucking door! Why you shut your fucking mouth? Whoa! Hey, right, hey guys, hey guys, you heard of Twitch Prime? Hey guys, you heard of Twitch Prime? Hey bro, what? I'm going to enjoy it, you'd have been proud of me then. I got a quad to start running over someone. Mm -hmm. I was getting damaged when I was going through fire damage. Mm -hmm. I went to run over this guy, I was just doing you turn it, a tree and blew up. <laughs> I wouldn't expect anything. I was so I proud would, of myself. I wouldn't expect anything less. Look at all these names, it looks like he's going crazy with these names on the wall. So... <laughs> oh, you probably couldn't see it. Um, so, so the favourite, eh? Um, started good. Started really good, but the ending was like. 
Yeah. What the? What do you think? Started strong but ended bad. Yeah, I think it was like it was a bit like no, it was like a cop out ending. Yeah. yeah. A cop out ending. Yeah. Yeah, it kind of. I think they ran out of time to film it. <laughs> She's like, yeah, shall I, go to, shall I go to the shop and we get some toast? Yeah, let's have some toast. Look how she's presented it. On a board with some banana. Lovely. Is the Nutella here for dipping in or? <laughs> no, 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 no. So is this raspberry jam? No. That's raspberry jam. Strawberry butter. Strawberry butter. It's not. This is sour. Lovely day in England right now, and because it's a lovely day in England, we're going to drive off to a place called Castleton. Uh, I used to go to Castleton with my granddad all the time when I was younger with my grandma, because it's just a nice little place. Go and find a little uh, bakery or whatever and have some food. So it's about 40 minutes away. Next up, Castleton. Uh, uh, Castleton. And we made it. She's getting a ticket. We've made it to Gashelton, aka the middle of bum truck nowhere. So I put these, oh damn it, maybe I need the engine on for that. I put these windows up, she's gonna get the ticket. I'm gonna go and find somewhere to have some food. Like, as a kid, my dad used to take me hiking and stuff all the time. And me and my sister used to hate it, like, we know, we know, we know, we know, we know, we know, we know. But then like, the older I get, I'm like, I love that. Like, I, I loved it when I was doing it. No, like, I didn't bring you a wig enough coat. <laughs> It's cold. <laughs> How nice is the drive here? Yeah, it was really nice. Lovely, wasn't it? Yeah. It's like we're in Game of Thrones territory. I should have filmed someone on your phone. I'll film it on my way back. Yeah, we'll, show, we'll film you, the exit of Castleton. I filmed loans, but I filmed it's... it that way for Instagram, so sorry. Can't use vertical footage. <laughs> oh, no. I came to bring Lydia to this, like, gorgeous little tea room, and it's closed. There's one there, though. There's one there. We'll go that one. Oh, Tillys of Castleton, what have you done? You've bloody closed on us, your sausages. Why? No! I'm so sorry. You can't make that up. The one day we come and it's closed. Open all other days. Oh, yes. Look at the size of this chocolate cake. Ooh, that looks like. That looks nice. You can have this. And I'm eating. Ooh, I've got a nigger sandwich. This is a crisp. The reason I brought you here <laughs> is because I want us to <clears throat> unravel the mysteries of the devil's ass and step into the peak. Mm -hmm. Ooh, it is cold, isn't it? I can feel my nipples just gone ding! I'm, I'm a good little romantic art. <laughs> Look at her, she's loving it. Before we go, I thought I'd take her for a walk along the river. Well, it's very cold. There's ice everywhere. Brrr, it's cold in here. Yeah, you do up there. She's got cankles. <laughs> Snack. Yay! Go on, Papi! Fucking can see! <laughs> Wait, is that your first win? Second ever solo. Your second ever solo win. What happened? What happened oh, in the end? Behind the tree, camping. Hey, look at everyone. Whoa. He was camping behind the tree. He was camping behind the tree, so I clicked him, he hit me, but I thought, he's not pushing me there. So I started medding up through <laughs> one cluster. Yeah. What do you do? Throw another cluster. Yeah. yeah. And boom, boom. <laughs> Just finished your session of gaming. We only secured one dub. One W, one W, 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 Two for me today. Uh, two for, because Kyle got his solo, which you bloody saw. Wow. Reaction of King that. Mm. But we tried the new game mode that Blackout brought out. And how mental is that game mode? We played with Hex, Terrorizer, me and Kyle. And it was... Popping. It's mental. Like, you, you, you can get so many kills and be so aggressive. But if one person out of the squad that you wipe survives, everyone else can spawn back in. So you could kill, like, 40 people... And like you know, forty people, and then like thir thirty-six of them can still spawn back in. Literally, that's about thirty-six uh, of them can spawn back in and still come back kill you, which is just mental. To congratulate you on your win tonight, I've made you. Uh, do, you do you eat medium or well? Medium. Good. Well, that is medium as tits. A medium, medium ribeye steak. Thanks. I want to. I, I want. You didn't get one of the good steaks. That's a Tesco steak, but it's still nice. Right. How's it looking? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's looking pretty medium. I like that. I like that. All right, go for it. What, what? Is it good? Yeah. Oh!
pretty good at There's seasoning no it. There's no sauce and it tastes mm, amazing. Mm, 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 exactly, mm, that's just the salt mm, 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 mm. I'm a secret sauce, just same. Oh. You almost tried to eat one of these gingerbread bands and I did the same thing. So one of them's got no legs by accident because I, I almost ate one. one no, you can't. Why? Th they're made for me. So I eat one every single day. And by the time I get to the last one, that's the day I got on the plane to fly to Lydia and see you. Very, very hot game. Yeah. But you can't have one. What do you mistake out of 10? Back off! What do you mistake out of 10? Uh, and it was just a step. Uh, nah, bro, you're not allowed a gingerbread man! Wait, I've got a gingerbread man, you can have, wait. Oh, wait, you are, Oh, you already brought me that big one, didn't you? Damn it, the joke won't work. What do you mistake out of 10? No, honestly, with no sauce, you can actually appreciate the taste of the steak. So I'm gonna give you a solid nine. Oh! Five! Oh! <laughs> you would've got a 10 if you give me some SA sauce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I actually have fucking loads of it as well, but. Sorry about that one. Uh, I know, I've nearly ate one. Look how sad she is to leave. Oh, it's okay. Oh, baby. Oh. It's just your emotions playing with you. Oh, I'm actually going to cry at the airport tomorrow. I'm like, don't let go, Jack. There's more than enough room on this door. Because there clearly was, and she should have let him on. Don't what are you doing? Don't leave me. <laughs> Look at you, though. Oh! <laughs> it's okay. Look, I'm gonna cook you our last dinner. This is gonna be a good dinner, right? I just hate packing, look. that's why I'm crying. Yeah, yeah, look, she's she's really upset. Look at yourself, though. No, it's ugly. <laughs> no, it's not ugly. Right, I'm cooking up some ribeyes right now. Um, on my new pan! Managed to get this bad boy, which is super dangerous because this is gonna get really hot, but apparently this will make it so my steaks don't look so nuked on top and just give them grill lines instead, so. Okay, duck it, Jens. Okay, new pan. Let's have a look. Oh, that does look medium. Weird unsalted butter. That's definitely different. Oh. Not flavorful. Oh! I feel like, I feel like there's too many variables that we've changed. Not only have we used the wrong salt, uh, no, the wrong butter, we used a different pan and a different steak. It cuts yeah. like more of a beefier steak, I'm saying that right now. Yeah, but it's like, definitely a bit of crispier. But it's not flavorful, is it? I cooked that exactly medium, bloody hell, look at that. Mm. Wow, that's right, real medium. Up. Yeah. Mm. It is flavorful, but it's not as flavorful. Mm. That's a good potato, babe. That's a good mushroom. Yeah, yeah, did good, but I don't know, there's too many variables different this time. Mm, where's my sauce? Oh, there's dry mix oh. sauce. Dry mix sauce. Oh, that's a good looking sauce, that is. Oh, yeah. Mm. Oh, yeah, that's a good sauce. Ready? That's a good sauce. Mm. <laughs> it's currently 7 o'clock in the morning. Olivia's dress, dressed naked right now, so I can't film her. Oh, wait, she's ready. Are you excited? Uh, yeah. You get your bags back? I don't know. I'm like, wait. Because we need to go. Alice is going to kill me because I've only got one of those, but you can take it. Why do we want one? Because they were limited. They were very, very limited. We need to not be here anymore. Let's go, 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 go. Come on now. Come on, we gotta go. Wanna know what a suitcase for traveling for five weeks looks like? That. Look at the size of that bastard. That's a big old boy, that right there. Damn. Oh, right, okay, so we're gonna uh, drive down to Jenny. You remember we saw Jenny down in London. We're gonna go see Jenny, pick her up, drive to the airport, drop him off, and say toodle pip. Your hat and your dot and your Timberlands in there, do you need them? No, I've got room. Do you want the hat? I've got one pair of Do you want the hat? I've got a hat. She's got a hat. All right, I think that's everything, let's go. The spaceship awaits. All right, give me the bag. How big is it? Oh, what? That's tiny compared to Lydia's. I've got all these presents. I'll get them there yeah. safely, don't worry. <sighs> we didn't make it far, did we, Jenny? Nope. She already forgot her coat. Are you surprised? Still in hide. I'm glad she forgot it in hide, though. Not in yeah, at least we didn't get to the airport and then she was like panic mode. Not in Mumbai, oh shit, I forgot my coat. Oh god, my nipples feel like icebergs. It's so, oh dear. It's so chilly today. <sighs> my god. Oh, cast went. Right? As far as I'm aware. What? Oh, yeah, Jenny's not going. Psych, I'm going instead. Jenny's staying in the car. 
They could got there on time. So I say on time. The coke situation didn't help, but bags arrived, girls have arrived. Jenny's bag. Lydia's bag. It doesn't look it, but there is definitely a size and weight difference. Bye bye. I love you. Text me if you need anything. If you need me to go to the house and come back, I will. Bye. Don't let go. Don't let go. Lydia's not been even gone a minute. <laughs> and I'm already jumping on blackout. It's like eight o'clock in the morning. And I'm like, well, I'm not going back to bed. I'm trying to get my sleep schedule still on track and be scheduled for this because I don't know if you guys know, or I've mentioned this in the vlog, but I've got a KFC uh, sponsored tournament coming up where I'm competing with like one of you guys uh, to try and win 50K. And uh, you better know, I'm trying to win you that money because like I love blackout and all I want to do is play all day, every day. Uh, like I literally eat, sleep, dream and think blackout. So I'm just gonna keep up the hustle, man. Keep playing, keep training, and I will be one of the greatest blackout players of all time. <laughs> all right, adventure two of the day. What are we doing? You don't take me to go get my Curtis car because my car radiator is blown up and it's. Oh like no, let me in. Oh, fine, I'm not coming upstairs then. <laughs> Come on, we need to go. I have two seconds. Come on. Where's Alice? Did you go there to that appointment? Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. My granddad's got a massive, massive doctor's appointment today, and we need to talk to you guys about some stuff. But before we know any more information, we're not, we're not jumping to conclusions or saying anything. So as soon as we know, you'll know. So just uh, send your love and wishes, homies. Send your love and wishes. Oh, nice looking stream room, Carl. He's got a snowman. He's got plug sockets. What? Carl, you were supposed to get the plug sockets with the USBs on it! Oh. Oh, he doesn't. I thought he did, but then he doesn't. Damn it! He was supposed... Wait, one sec. He was supposed to get these ones, look! Plug sockets with USBs on the top of them. He's not bloody done it for his office. Look okay. it. Just, just in case anyone breaks it. He's not bloody put them in! What a sausage! Well, this is going to be Carl's streaming room. <laughs> <laughs> yep, just doing a sound test for him for when he screams. But, uh, Carl and Alice's room's looking well nice. Look at the colour. Almost inspired by my house. Silver and grey, grey and silver, grey and white. It's lovely. Nice bed. That's a nice bed. I like that my bed's a floaty bed, but I've always wanted like, like, um, you know, what's it called? What's it called? Back, backboard, backboard. I've always wanted a backboard. And you know what? I really miss radiators. I'll build a new house one day. Guarantee it. Whoa! <laughs> God, I won't film in the other way, fucking hell. So I live up on a hill in the area and Alice Carl live even higher up in the area, which is pretty goddamn high. And it's that higher up that, oh, my grass has gotten frosty. Ooh, listen, listen to that. Frosty, ooh, yes. Ooh, yes. Now, if this nimwit will hurry up, I can get my day started. I've kind of already started it by taking Lydia there, but um, you know what I mean, get started. I don't want to get started. I want to go a little play blackout all day, but I can't play blackout all day because I've got to take him to stop or drop his car off. I'll have to get his car. Also, he's been doing bloody tire burns on their drive. <laughs> what the fuck? Are you wearing a uniform? No. <laughs> he does actually have a real job. No. Everyone thinks he just comes around to mine and plays video games. No, no, no. Oh my god, I need to do a day in the life of Carl. Yeah. Oh, I'd love to come around and film what he does for a day. I have no fucking clue. I don't care, man, you're a mad salesman, isn't it? Did you like the back? Have you had a haircut? Yeah, look fresh, don't I? When did you get a haircut? Just now, that was my appointment, I told you. That was my hair appointment. With Scott? Yeah. Scotty! Legend! I know you watch your vlogs. Bro, you look fucking trim. You pretty fucking fresh, don't I? I'd bang it. Well, after I seen your cock and bollocks there, You actually like, seen me cock? I bloody... Saw a lot. Saw what I needed to see. Going Didn't to new levels, aren't we? What? Going to new levels, aren't we? I thought you said Arabian goggles, aren't we? I was like, no, we're not Arabian goggles. Don't Google it. <laughs> Bye, Carl. Love you. Thank you so much. It's weird you've been up at this time. I know. 9.39 in the morning. Double like. like you. Double like. you, TF. Yeah, in the daytime, you have a job. I know, right? Uh, this is me going to work. <laughs> See you later now. I'm going to drive off with all your gear in the boot. <laughs> what, wait, is this your side job? You work at Volkswagen as well? Get out of my car! You need a great deal on your Volkswagen. <laughs> need a new boiler and a new car? Yeah. Carl's turned up. How are you doing, mate? And Tony stole a PlayStation. Tony, to the dark side. This is it. This is your relationship over. This is your your daughters are never gonna see you again. You're never gonna ride your bike. <laughs> the hyper blackout has taken over. Tony, Tony, 
Good luck, Godspeed. <laughs> yeah, I was just about to say, is this your fucking Volkswagen? Do you want to show me it? Let's go check out Carl's courtesy car in it. Mate, I don't care if it's a basic bitch. If I drop you off this morning, I want to see it. I'm going to go Tokyo Drift Carl's car now, boys. Where's my shoe? Let's get a shoe. What's it called it? Kanye. Kanye? Oh, Kanye. <laughs> 68 play looking on me. Oh, oh um, England, 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 England. No, no. What's it not to 60 on it? Oh, wait, what? That's slow. Oh, interior. Not exactly your kind of cup of tea, I wouldn't say. Why is there? It's got Beats by Dre built into it. A Rastafari. Did it come with this or is this yours? No, that's mine. Oh, two USB slots. That's pretty good. Look at that. Wow. Wow. No built-in like Wow. Go on, Tokyo, drift it away. Oh, wait, what? There's a Beats by Dre logo on the outside. Wait, is this actually a Beats version? Oh, give it a rev. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Calm down. You can't, like, convert. I can't take it. <laughs> Sounds like a bag of bolts. Oh. Whoa, calm down, all right, calm down. Time to eat my dinner and play some blackout. Mine, that engine sounded like it was about to do burnouts outside my house. What the fuck are the rims about? Um, I really don't know about that. Hey, I prefer your actual it's a, yeah, car. It's a no from me. Well, that one's broken and, hey, no, next week, cool. next week, might be getting rid of it. Hey, don't get back, what are you doing? Kicking my car. Yeah, take that. Showered, feeling fresh. I have, mate, I'm talking about being scheduled and organised and all that sort of stuff. And bloody cow turned up with my lunch two hours late. I'm, I'm supposed to be, like, getting up nine o'clock, you know, coming off at half past twelve, uh, you know, from gaming, the session all day, and being organised. And when my dinner turned up bloody late, my life falls apart. So anyway, I've had a shower, I've got a cup of tea, I'm going to play video games for the rest of the day. And get, by the way, guys, if you're wondering over the next three weeks, uh, one, why there's never been a vlog and never time ever, which is normal. Uh, but if you're wondering where I am half the days, just go to twitch.tv forward slash syndicate. You'll find me there playing video games. Just saying. Look at us trying to take it fucking seriously. Oh, nice no. shirt, bro. Like, nice shirt. Where'd you, you get it? Know, I don't know where you get it, bro. Where'd you get it? Syndicateoriginal.com. Link in the description. Yeah. Uh, uh, now, sell out Tom. Gone for a second. Um, we pop, yo, we've popped up, so we had two wins together, mm -hmm. two wins together, some insane plays, like absolutely insane plays, and now we're doing a dinner break, rather than sitting eating the stream doing it, it's healthy to yeah. just step away, refresh your, your mind, eyes, yeah. yeah, just relax a second, chill, and just eat some food, and then we're going to be back streaming, twist.tv, Forrester Syndicate. Twitch.tv forward slash cow. Twitch.tv forward slash syndicate. Twitch.tv forward slash cow. Twitch.tv forward slash syndicate. If you're not a follower, you go now. All right? Go now. Right now. Stop watching. Pause it. Go there. Follow. And then you can see that shit pop off. Yeah, there you go. Mate, this food's insane. I like it. Not as good as you stay, but it's good. Ooh. Well, we enjoyed dinner together. And now... It's time to eat my first gingerbread man out of all of these gingerbread man. I've got to eat one a day. Mm. They need to go a bit softer. They need a bit more time to chill out. But she's made me a gingerbread man every single day she's gone. I love it. Bro, two o'clock in the morning. Smash it. I've had five wins in total tonight. I've had nine today. Nine today. And we've had five together. Twitch TV, follow us, Carl. Twitch TV, follow us, Syndicate. Ooh, starting my day off on a cold, cold England. And I've had this delivered, an El Gato Camling. Um, I don't think I ordered it. So, when I'm streaming up there, I have this uh, webcam that's kind of like potato quality. Kind of like this phone. It's kind of a potato, so what I can do is connect that camera to this PC via this. So you see, you plug it in and it wires all the way to your camera. And then that way, I can not look like a potato on live stream. So that's a win, but what's not a win is it's three o'clock. It's three o'clock in the afternoon. I've only just woken up. My sleep schedule has gone to shit. Lydia has left for two days, two days, and it's all fallen apart. So I'm getting up, I'm showering. 
I'm gonna play video games today after I go for a meal with my mum. I'm gonna play video games all day until I'm tired as hell, sleep, and then force myself up at 9am tomorrow. Because this is unacceptable! Every time I come to my mum's house, I'm never sure if it's her house. So I always take a risk knocking on the door. Is this the right house? Hello? I just, I, I think I heard a faint noise, so I'm taking that as a come in. Hello? Yep, just checking this is the right house. Hello? Every time I come to this house, I'm always like, is this the right one? This is the one thing I wish I would have put in my house, a proper, proper fire. Like we were gonna do it, but then the chimney breast that I'd have to put in would have stuck out the wall, like messed up my drive. So we were like, nah, sack that. But I want one really badly. I reckon I burned down my house if I actually had a real fire. I always mess with fire though. I just want to poke it with a stick. What are you trying? Bring it back to bloody life. What? It needs trimming. Mum, there's no bloody leaves on it. These are all right. Mum, it's supposed to be green. It, it, they don't shed the leaves. <laughs> well, they're supposed to be green all year round. Yeah, it's a bonsai tree. Not like they don't shed the leaves in No. no. Well, You've absolutely them. murdered that, Mum. I'm trying my best. All these and <laughs> these, when you shoot, and then they're green, then they fell off. But... <laughs> yeah, I think it's dead. Look, I have a spray for Wow. <laughs> Wow. Well, thank you for inviting for me to dinner. Do you know what? I miss a radiator. I keep saying this. My house. Oh, is it on? Yeah, God. You know, like you can just stand. You know, when you come in from the outside, me, I have to lie on the floor and hold my underfloor heating's on. Oh, that is well nice. But we got pork, carrots, roasties. Goodbye now. I love you. High five. See you soon. Goodbye. I'll be the same. Cheers. I don't know the words to that song. I will have to get you up for food either. Before Lydia's back or when she's back. I prefer when she's back because then you'll have vegetables with your meal. <laughs> yeah, we can actually. All right, love you. Bye. Young man, did you order, Chippy? Yeah. Then let's do it. So, guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like rating. Yes, that is a man-child of a face. Pubes stuck to my chin. I am zooming, zooming out slowly. I wish you could do it faster, but this button, this, this is as fast as it goes. But, guys, I just want to say thank you very much for uh, for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed, enjoyed the life of Tom in a week. Week in the life of Tom is exactly what I meant to say. Uh, this new camera setup is epic. Feeling organized. That's all I can say. I'm doing my gaming, doing my streaming, Orion's uploading. You might be like, what, 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 wait, I, I really need like a really quick, fast zoom button. Where's it drift? Where's it drift? Where's it drift? We're waiting on Hex. I don't know what, what else to say other than we're waiting on Hex. So as soon as I can record that, we'll be back on track. Um, other than that, thank you once again. Again, all the love for my granddad and all that sort of stuff. Uh, and uh, if you want to tune in to watch some Blackout, the new channel, like I said, twitch.tv. Uh, forward slash syndicate is where I stream it but if you want to subscribe to syndicate royale go to youtube.com forward slash syndicate royale I'll put a link down in the description go subscribe to the channel I post nearly every day there just saying epic gameplays for your faces and yeah all's good in the hood so I'm organised I'm streaming I'm getting up at a good time most days some days kind of days I'm daily vlogging and I'm daily streaming wow life is good guys I love you I leave you and it's adios Oh yeah, and by the way, whilst this video goes up for the duration of 24 hours, the code for Syndicate Original, getting yourself some discount. One sec, you ready for this? Ta-da! Ta-da! Oh, if you go to syndicateoriginal.com, guys, you will indeed be able to use the code 100K to get yourself 10% discount off. So, uh, you've got 24 hours starting now. Enjoy, and goodbye!